Yo, 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 what's going on, gamers? Your boy I Maverick here, back with the auction block series. Let's turn that mic down a little bit. Alright, so let's go through our binder, man. Um, we have. We have some new elites. We got some new elites that we gotta check out. You know what? First, let's do let's do this first. First, let me check out the Super Bowl set since I have yet to do that. There's also a new promo up. We have the I think it's legend packs. Alright, three three sets here. Add the five gold Super Bowl moment collectibles to this set to earn one random Super Bowl coin up collectible okay add the 20 super bowl players to this set to earn the mystery super bowl mvp collectible that can be used after the super bowl to claim the 99 overall super bowl mvp player okay add the 20 super bowl moment collectibles to this set to earn one random super bowl legend who are the super bowl legends I don't know that I know that. Bobby Wagner. Ooh. I wonder how expensive this set is going to be. See how much Edelman's going for. Okay, not bad, not bad. By the way, you guys will get some gameplay, I think, tomorrow of the Xbox squad. But it will not be with uh, Dick Lane. Y'all won't get that till next week. That that footage was already recorded. Just a heads up. Okay, I mean these elites hitting decently, hitting decently. <sighs> I'm pretty sure Bobby Wagner is not gonna get no burn on my squad. See, now I'm just curious, though, on whether the Super Bowl MVP card is going to be auctionable and how much he'll potentially go for. All right, let's try and do this set. It might be fun. Sets are fun. Let's try and do that. Um... Alright, and now let's see if we have enough to do a large quick sale. Because they're fun, people. I like doing large quick sales because they're fun for me. Like, man, why did you why did you put emphasis on that? The, the, the fact that you're doing it because it's fun. Just in case. Just in case anyone has some issues with what I do with my coins. It's because it's fun to me. <laughs> um... That light in the background is kind of annoying. We'll be alright though. That was definitely a shot at everyone. It was uh, booty hurt of the hilarious uh, bidding war video with me and Trent. It was funny. My wife was my wife was um because she was seeing on Twitter everyone was freaking out about Trent, and she don't like she'll watch like she likes watching daily dose videos and interacting in the comments or videos that she's in. Um, but besides that, she'll just check videos out if there's like, you know, buzz on Twitter. And she was like, yo, everyone is cracking up about this video that Trent sent. So she was checking it out. She's like, why are these people mad about you spending coins? And just hearing her girl logic was funny. She was like, wait. So they're mad about the coins you spent on a player. I was like, yeah. She was like, wait. They were your coins or their coins? I was like, oh no, they were my coins. They're like, did they did they give you the coins? I was like, no, no. We you know we bought the packs and you know we got players from the packs and then I sold those players to get the coins. She was like, wait, but they're your coins. She, I was like, yeah. She's like, wait, but they're mad. Well, how you spent your coins? I was like, yeah. And she just face palmed. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's that's um. That's YouTube for you, right? 
but yeah, if, if um, and obviously I'm not talking to everyone because most people thought it was funny. Um, but just to you know, a heads up for anyone that ever feels enraged um, by stuff like that. That's that's gonna be a norm here. Uh, which which it shouldn't surprise y'all. I, I do a lot of weird things. Like I'll play, I'll start players that aren't really that good, just because it's fun to me. And then even back then, I had even like last year, I had people that were like heated, like man, why are you starting a sixty overall quarterback? People will come by the PlayStation videos like, why is he starting Dimps? He has better running backs. Cause it's fun to me. I play the game with how, how it's fun for me. You you pay Joe sixty little dollars, so you sit in your home, you go home. And you play the game how it's fun for you. If a ninja want to overbid a million coins on something, I'm going to do it. Especially if I get a hilarious video out of it. So, um, if you are, if you're, if you're, if you're very uptight, this probably isn't a good channel for you. Ooh, Vaughn. But that, I forgot we pulled some goons. Oh, we got some decisions to make. We got some decisions to make. Oh, we got some decisions to make. All right, I know Bennett's going up, though. I know Bennett's getting sold. I know Blunt's getting sold. Maxwell is getting sold. Who else? K Short is getting sold. What is he? DT? Panthers. Is is Bennett a DT left in? Left in. Um, got all them coin ups, man. Got all them coin ups. Hey, what set did these go into? Team of the year? Did these team of the year sets expire? See, that's why I gotta, I gotta be a little bit more diligent, so I can make sure I'm getting in. Look at that Dick Lane right there. Oh, Dick Lane. Um Let's look at our let's look at our overall squad though real quick. I'm eating grapes. Hmm. Higher strength. Man, see how you got 90 run block, though. 98 pass block, 88 Im impact. Do I want to take the two-point decrease in the run block for the two increase in the pass block? And the eight in the impact? And the four in the strength? I would say yes, unless he goes for a good price. Unless he goes for a good price. Hey, what's up? Okay, I'm recording. I'll be done by the time you get back. All right, love you. All right, bye. All right, so pull up our tr our handy dandy mudhead.com. Again, links in the description for all these. Um, all of these, um, any website or tool that you see me using. I'm going to just look them up real quick, get a gist of how much he goes for. Okay, about 60K according to Mudhead. And Deerdorf, according to Mudhead, is going for 42K. So I'm going to keep Deerdorf. I'm going to just sell my man. Um... Pets. Um, 
Okay. Uh, who else? Who else? What is up with our right guard situation? You know what? Let's do this. Let's generate best lineup. All right, still in ninety four. Um, what is up with these golds? We don't. We never picked up a right guard. How did I? Why did I not pick up a right guard? I feel like I remember I didn't get a left tackle. Because Bushrod wasn't that bad. If, if I think I remember that. Damn, we gotta get a right guard, y'all. Okay. Um, and then at tight end, we're gonna start Donald Penn. That has been one of the biggest adjustments we've made. I really liked that. Um, having Donald Penn there. Having Delaney in the slot. He's been making plays. Like some huge blocks. Um, we could use better wideouts. Our wideouts are a little dated, but, you know. We haven't had no issues from our gameplay. Uh, you can't look at the gameplay and be like, yeah, if only your your wide receivers did better. They've been doing fine. And I'm really not about just upgrading because I need to upgrade. Oh, I want a head coach. That's what we need. We need to get a head coach. Ooh. And then so it's like, do we still want to go after Ronnie Lott? Because I think I still want to keep Earl starting so that we can get the hit power boost right and then at water at the strong safety jack ham's been balling Suggs. i don't really notice have y'all noticed Suggs making any plays i haven't noticed if he has been um, cause then from there, you know what? Let's do this. Let's try this. Let's give Chancellor. Let's give Chan Cammy Cam Cam a chance. Cause I wanted the Lambert. I kind of wanted Lambert. Um. I wanted 99 Sherm too. I'm just trying to think of what order I want to do things. 99 Sherm is going to be another grind for us. Look at that dick lane. Look at them stats, bruh. Oh, man. I wish I could have another dick lane. Wish I could have two dicks. That'd be dope. Alright, so we're just reevaluating the squad right now. Hold on, hold on. Okay, so so biggest priorities. I'm more of a defensive guy, man, just because I still feel like defense can be harder. They've made huge improvements um to the defense this year, huge, like in years past. It's so much easier to play defense than it's been in the past, but it's still. It still can be tough to stop a really good player. So that's why, especially in mud, I like to have my defense as stacked as possible. So that's why you guys see me not really prioritizing my offensive games. But that line, got to get some love. Okay, so I'm going to go head coach, O-line. We could get new wideouts, but we don't need them. We just don't need them. 
for what we've been doing. If anyone says we need new wideouts, you you, you tripping, you're tripping. Um, D line. Then I'm thinking just jumping to Sherm, man, because I'm not upset with my safeties. Um, you know, wouldn't be bad to get a taller safety, but the two hit power is kind of beautiful. I mean, it's kind of beautiful. And then if I can get a head coach, because the head coach I want, I don't even remember who it was, but it, it has a plus two hit power as well. Then we go in Sherm, man. Then we go in Sherm. Yeah, we might have to compare some stats, so. Let's compare some stats. Let's get an idea of Sherm's price. How much is how much is Sherm going for nowadays? Was crazy after that um after we bid and we got that night train like the next day there was like night trains up for one point six one point seven still don't take it back um oh one point two oh heck yeah oh yeah we getting sure that ain't even that hard. Six three. Ooh. That agility. Higher man. Lower zone. Ninety six press. We really need to be comparing him to Rod Woodson now. Cause that's who he's gonna be replacing. Same zone. A little bit higher man. Ninety six press. Six three. What's his jump? 96 versus 94 jump 72 tackle versus 78 okay a little bit less there what's the block shed sixty two block shed versus seventy four block shed people ask man why do you care about block shed because a lot of runs especially if it could be like a strong power and they're about to take it to the outside they're about to go home and they just need that wide receiver to hold that block for them to get gone. And then, what the hell, nigga, you get that block shed and that tackle. And they're pissed off. That is what I be lo loving. Eighty six spec catch. Seventy two hit power versus that eighty six hit power, too. And if you have a corner come up and boom on a running back, that's always good. Which is the main reason I like Night Train. Okay, let's see what Night Train's block shed is. 82. Oh, wee. Oh, wee. My man got that linebacker type block shed. To be honest, yo, Rod Woodson isn't a bad card, though. I don't know that we need to be in a rush to. Well. The Sherm might be a better look for, like, you know, D against the lobs. Let's see how Night Train is going to play that, too. 6 1. 92 catch? I didn't even realize he had 92 catch. That Night Train card is ri ri ridiculous. Um, 90 tackle, too? Come on now. 96 jump? Okay. Ooh. <laughs> I'll let y'all vote on that. I don't know if we need to be in a rush to get Sherm because Rod is pretty nice. Rod is pretty nice. Um, I mean, we'll see. We'll get there. So let's um, we'll get there. Um, how long is this video? Oh, we're hitting twenty minutes. 
Alright, so for the next video, we'll, we'll, we'll put up these players that we got here. Um, we'll also probably add to that because I'm going to do a pack opening later today. So we'll probably have more, more uh, players. So this was a good evaluation video. Y'all feel free to give your two cents on the squad. Um, I'm going to look up a head coach here. I can't remember. Was it Garrett? No. Might have been Jimmy. I think it was Jimmy. No. That's plus two agility. It wasn't the Jimmy Johnson car that had the t plus hit power. Dang. Y'all let me know what coach it is that has there's like has like a plus two hit power. But I feel like there was two types of Jimmy Johnsons. Maybe it was the other one. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comment section. Um all right, so we didn't make any moves, but we, we we got a good game plan together. We got a good game plan on what we're going to do for the squad, which is important. And I'm lost, my bad. I already did the large quick sale, so let's go. Let's open it up. Call this a video. And we'll probably open in veteran packs later because those, those legend packs are going to be for the wager. All right. We got to get our coins back up, man. We need to get our coins back up so a large quick sale hit would be beautiful. Holla at your boy. Oh, bro. You f dude, don't you feel like eventually I got to hit? Eventually. I've done this so many times and I keep coming up short. I need motivation to keep going. If some of y'all have hit lately, let me know. The large quick sale. I don't know where some of your minds could have just went. The large quick sale. If you hit the jackpot on the large quick sale lately, let me know. I uh, appreciate y'all rocking with your boy. Y'all be easy. Till next time. God first. God bless.